The Lumion library is tailored for everyone's needs. It contains a vast series of 3D objects that you can place in your scenes to complement your design with realistic context, landscape, and activity. In this video, I'm going to show you the new 2D billboard object so you can quickly populate your scenes with realistic people and truly tell a captivating design story. Lumion has always included a number of billboard objects of people. You can find them under People and Animals in subcategories People 2D Silhouettes and People 2D. Such billboards are 2D images, which automatically face the camera. So a 2D image can give the illusion of a 3D object. Lumion 12 now allows you to add your own custom 2D people straight into your project. You can add your cutout people, trees, or plants and realize your vision of the built environment. Various online resources allow you to download 2D assets, sometimes for free. On the Lumion community pages, we maintain a list of useful links in the resources category. Take a look at the official Lumion list of texture collections and find what best suits you in the 2D people and cutouts section. VizHopper is a great place to start. It has over 8,000 cutout people in its collection and offers a great way to search and select the image you like. Let's grab this free model and place him in an example scene. Under the Utilities category, select the Character Billboard object and place it in the scene. Once you select it, in the top right corner, the properties and settings of the object allow you to load a texture. Select the image we just downloaded. As soon as it's imported, you will notice that it's a bit too small and seems like it's floating above the ground. Let's fix that. In Photoshop, it becomes clear that the texture has a few empty pixels in the lower part of the image. It's always better to make those images fit perfectly to the canvas area. We can fix this with the crop function in Photoshop. Let's also reduce the size to save on memory. Since the image will usually be seen from a distance, it takes up only a small part of the rendered image. So a size of 1024 pixels for the largest side is usually sufficient. The standard billboard size is one meter by one meter. So we could scale it with a factor of 1.8 if that's the height of the person. With the shift key pressed down, you can be very precise when scaling your model. To get the size right, you can also temporarily add a Lumion person of similar height next to it. When we circle around the object, you can see that the picture keeps facing you. You can also see that the right foot of the butler is in the air. In general, the use of billboard images from photographs only works out if the camera angle is roughly the same for the picture and the render. And we're ready to make some renders. You can also use these billboards for your own photographs of people. For example, if you design a custom house for a family, you could place the family itself in your design to whet their appetite. For the best results, take a picture of your subject with a contrasting background, like a white sheet. Load it in Photoshop. Photoshop has a great new object selection tool, which can automatically take away the background of a picture. Just drag a box around the person and copy the automatic selection into a new file. There is your new cutaway person, ready to go into Lumion. Another great use for billboards is to employ them as explanatory markers in early design stages. I'll show you how to do this using PowerPoint. Make a new blank presentation. Take away the default text boxes. Add a rectangle with rounded corners. Select a style you like. For example, this one will give it a bit of a 3D look. Add a text box in the center and type new swimming pool. Make it larger. Add an arrow below it and give it the same style. Save it first in PowerPoint format and then another time in PNG format. In Photoshop, we have to take away the background again. This time, use the magic wand. Unlock the background, select the magic wand, click on the white areas, and delete them. Bring the image into Lumion as a billboard object. Voila! Adding a few billboards with people is a great way to activate your scenes and breathe even more life into your design. Who wants to see a lifeless image anyway? 
Now, go give it a shot on your projects. I'll see you next time.